start with the higher time frames, and then uh, you know you get the picture about the overall technical look and where the price belongs, like we did here. And you say, if the somebody moved the floor down to 65, for instance, and the thing's sitting at 75 like it was today, see, you've got $10 that it could slide to the downside and make a very easy move. See, so the options on something like, even like the XLE, just the move today, that dollar and seventy cent move uh, today, and it was more than that. It was almost two dollars from the high to the low, or, or more than two dollars, right at two dollars from high to low today. So, if you look at the XLE options uh, just today, and the options that expire this week, and uh, you know this is the energy index, and you can look at that means probably the USO, uh, the oil index, and everything is probably very closely mimicking what this is showing. But uh, I can look at the uh, 71, 72, 73 uh, puts and things like that on the energy index. But just as an example, I'll just show you that uh, the XLE energy index opened this morning at 28 cents, and then it dropped down a couple pennies lower than that, and then went to a high of 64 cents, and it's near that at the close. See, so that's almost triple your money. Now, from the longer term perspective, if you're looking at a chart like you're seeing here, the energy index daily chart, and what we were looking at on a monthly and weekly chart and all that kind of stuff. Now, keeping that technical weakness in perspective, and if it said the floor should have been down here at 65, can you see that if you drop the ball off the building, that it's not supposed to hit the sidewalk until it gets here. You can see that, can't you? I mean, I don't have to stand out here with a big flag waving it around and say, hey, 65, 65, 65, 65, do I? You all can see it just as easily as I can, can't you? That when you overlay this technical picture on the price, this is what it says, right? I didn't invent it. That I'm just overlaying this angle on the price. That's all. 